Well, we begin with that lockdown and heavy police presence at HM King High School in Kingsville today after it was reported a student possibly had a weapon on campus. After an extensive search, police say a weapon was never found and no students were injured. Our Bill Churchwell reports from Kingsville for us. This is an incident that had a lot of parents on high alert and law enforcement officers on the scene at the school into the night. Now, while a weapon was never found on campus, police say they treat every situation like the real deal. H.M. King High School getting the all clear after a frantic day for students and staff following a report of a possible student with a gun. A student reported hearing, uh, overhearing something to one of our administrators. Superintendent Dr. Sissy Reynolds Perez said they have to take every comment seriously and immediately place the campus on lockdown. What I really appreciate is the fact that we had immediate law enforcement protection. Kingsville Police, the Claiborne County Sheriff's Office, DPS, U.S. Border Patrol, and several other agencies racing to the scene right around 3 p.m. It started freaking everyone out and I had called my grandma like seven times. It was my first time ever seeing like police with guns and like men, like a lot of them. Students tell 3 News their bags were searched before being led outside and brought here across the street. Walking out, everyone had to put their hands on each other's shoulders. Concerned parents and grandparents packed this nearby shopping center parking lot as they waited for updates and to find their kids. So I would think and I would suggest to them, to the school, that if they could please get like maybe an ID for each child so if something like this does happen yes, again, scan and go, scan and go, scan and go. Police Chief Ricardo Torres says after an extensive search, no weapon was ever found and no arrest made. Nor could it be verified that a weapon was ever present on campus. No student or faculty member was injured during this response. This is truly a learning experience. We do want to let everybody know that the drills that we put in place seem to work. It is an inconvenience, but our children are worth it. Our children are worth it. Bill Churchwell, 3 News. All right, Bill, thank you for those updates.